Hey guys, uh, today we're going to learn how to create and, uh, and start formatting your landing pages. Um, this is an example of uh, a header image that would be used inside the program called SP Page Builder. Um, and yeah, to do that, what we'll do, uh, we've got a page already created here, um, which we'll just open up. It's got nothing in it at the moment. Um, so the first thing that you would do is click Add New Row. Uh, once you've done that, you click Add New Add-on. You can also click it here as if, uh, if you wish. Once you've clicked that, you've got a choice of different things that you can add to the page. Um, today's one we're doing is just a standard image, nothing more. So we click the image. Um, from here, we can click the Upload an Image button and find our image. Um, by default, uh, it will take you to the, 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 the default page, but you can choose to put it inside a, a folder of your liking by clicking here. Um, we'll just double click our landings folder, which we created earlier. And if you haven't created a folder, you can just click the new folder up button up here. Once you've done that, um, you can click the upload files button and go and find your image, which we've got one preset up. Once that's uploaded, you click the image once and click insert. You'll see it here uh, appear here. Um, you can also change uh, it's like animation uh, for it to animate on the way in so we can turn on animation here and you've, you've got a choice of different ways you can animate it you can just play around uh, we'll just choose one which is just um, uh, let's use fade up fade in up and that's the amount of time it takes to do the animation and the amount of time it takes before the animation starts um, which, which you can play around with you click apply there once you've done that click save and then from the front end, it will appear as it does. That's it for this tutorial. Thank you, bye.